Hello, I'm Silvia Monge, an artist from Costa Rica. I want to thank Agus Budillanto for allowing me to share a little bit with all of you today, and above all, for giving the abstract watercolor an opportunity to have a place in an event of such quality as this one that, that you organized. Today, I'm going to do a demo of some trees that I saw yesterday at the park while I was working. One of the things I saw was a very strong tree, so I feel like this is the first thing I should do. That was the feeling, the very strong tree. I like to use the Arches Paper Hot Press because I, I work better without texture. the tree with the water because I feel like the tree has to go to has to be part of, of everything. Also did this had like shade to the floor and also the tree. I love to see how the branches intertwine with each other, like forming their, their own language and their own history. I will do that with liquid soap in this part. There were a lot of lines from the branches. Also, there were some more trees. Here's very dark. There was a road here that you could see there was taking you somewhere, but you didn't know where. And I think it's important to to put some mystery, you know, in the in the paint. 
paintings and not explain everything, but I think it's important for the people to, to, to ask questions, to feel, oh my God, what's that? Or where is it going? I told you all the language from the branches, from the trees. I love to do lines with a with a pencil with a brush because I think it's it's important to see the the strokes of the artist also to feel them when Even to play a little bit with the watercolor that you're doing and the people will, will ask you, what's that? Okay, just use your imagination and just think whatever you want, it's okay. Color, the watercolor can do a lot of nice things on the paper when it's just, you know, letting the water play with it, with the pigments and... Let the water work and then we'll see how it will turn out. 